Alright y'all, so I have a loaded envelope to share with you. Um, so the envelope, this envelope is I believe 5x5 five five, and this is Bumblebee themed and I love how this came out. I've been making a couple loaded envelopes for a couple different swaps and um, yeah, I just decided to make a Bumblebee one. So this is how it looks. And I was like, I put them all together, right? All the ones I did. I'm like, oh, wait, but I really, really want to video them because my camera's finally fixed. But now I have to take it all apart and put it back. <laughs> um, but anyways, the paper is from a hot buy pad from Michael's. And then from my Bumblebee collection of things, I have this black and white polka dot gross green ribbon and I just tied a bow around and then I have this image was sent to me in my flipbook kit from Chandy and then I had this letter B in my stash so I just put that on there and then I just uh, outlined it in black so it was kind of like hidden kind of um, so yeah so uh, I guess I'll start with these. So, this is, um, this is a little pick from New Year's Target's dollar spot last year. And I just tied a bow with this cute ribbon. Isn't this adorable? Oh my god, it's so cute. I love it. I love that ribbon. Um, and then I made this one. So I cut out... Um, a total of, and I ended up using all of them, I ended up, I made four of these bees, and then I believe I made three hives using my Cricut. Um, so look how cute! And the yellow cardstock is an embossed polka dot cardstock from AC Moore, and this one, I his little stripe, I put some bling on. This is a medallion um, from a sticker pack, I have no idea where I got them. Oh, and then I added little bling on his antennas. Um, and then I have a black crepe paper rosette. And then I covered the back. And then it's on a gold wand. And then I tied a bow with that ribbon again. Isn't he cute? And then um, I guess I'll just kind of just slide everything out. Oh, I also made this paper clip with that ribbon. That's what was on here. Um, I also covered the inside, because it was white, I covered the inside with black glitter cardstock. Um, this is just the cheap glittered paper from Walmart. Um, so, I guess I'm going to start from the let me start from the back so I can put stuff in as I do it. So, um, using that ribbon again, I tied together this pack of... I went through my Bumblebee collection. <laughs> so I have a ton of... I love Bumblebee. <laughs> so, I have these little buttons that are bees. And then I have some gold alphabet stickers. Then... Um, I have this pack of planner stickers that are black, gold, and white. And then I just cut out the paper, use scallop scissors, and then this is one of the dies from Allie. And I just cut it with coordinating paper. It's super cute. Sorry about the glares. Um, then I have this pack of bling in here. And then I have this little tag. This is from target dollar spot and then I have a little washi sample of like a beehive print so that goes in there then I have this little envelope and it says handmade on it because inside I have the I have two I have one of the hives I cut out and I have two of the bumblebees so the recipient can, can you know make their own 
projects with them. I'll have to like really fix this, but that's okay. Um, then I have these Bumblebee stickers and I made use that cardstock, use the topper die from Allie. It says B and there's a heart and I, I use some Christmas ribbon from Dollar Tree and I put some bling on there. Then this is a library pocket. It comes with the adhesive on it already. Um, these are there's packs of these for a dollar at um, AC Moore, and I just included some tags in here. So there's this one from I believe Celebrated at Michaels. This I got a Tuesday morning. A pack of these, and then this was just gifted to me, and it's a mason jar. So that goes, you know, with the bumblebees and. So, and then I just have one of the hives on there. And then, so this one says B and this one says hive. And it has the heart. Another little topper from Allie. And then I have some of Christina's um, rosettes in here. So black, white, black, yellow, white, and gold. So they can make their own embellishments. And then I have this hive and it's just um, like adhesive. So you can just pull it off if they want to. And then um, I added bling to this one. I'm just trying to put everything back the way I had it. It's always hard when you take it apart to show it. Um, and then I made a set of handmade embellishments and I did, I dug into my special paper collection. This is that heavy duty lace glitter paper from Michaels. And so all I did was I cut out some glittered yellow scallop circles, punched out the black circles, and then I had these little, um, these heart glitter stickers from Target, and then the bees stickers, and then I added just some bling on there, and then this topper, I used uh, corrugated cardboard paper, I have a little scrap of the ribbon, and one of the bumblebees, and then this one goes in here so let's let's see if I can get this oh bad kitty trying to eat my project so yeah there's that one if you guys have any questions feel free to just ask me um while I try to put this back the way it was. I'm getting there. <laughs> um, There we go. Sorry about the little silent. I had to get the cat out of the way. But yeah, there's my little bumblebee um, loaded envelope. Let me know what you guys think and I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye.